So, hey, um, I've got some more current event news, you know, um, that is equivalent to, you know, end time prophecies. So this was titled United States Downs Chinese Balloon Drawing a Threat from China. So there was this hot air balloon or something flying over the Atlantic Ocean. And it was over in the areas of the Carolinas from the United States. And Biden reported to China, the China lands and asked, you know, what was going on. They said it was a weather balloon that they were using and it must have drifted onto U.S. land or soils or whatever you want to call it. But they gave them a chance to get their balloon and take it back after a couple days, but nothing happened. So I'm gonna read you the story from the news. Okay, so it says, the United States military on Saturday shot down a suspected Chinese spy balloon off the Carolina coast after it transversed sensitive military sites across North America. China insisted the flyover was an accident involving a civilian aircraft and, threat and threatened repercussions. President Joe Biden issued the order, but had wanted the balloon down even earlier. On Wednesday, he was advised that the best time for the operation would be when it was over water. So United States officials said, military officials determined that bringing it down over land from an altitude of 60,000 feet would pose an undue risk to people on the ground, which is logical, right? So it goes on to say, China was, responded that it reserved the right to take further actions and criticized the United States for an obvious overreaction and a serious violation of international practice. Now, why are you internationally practicing with a hot air balloon that could pose a risk or threat to people when shot down or if shot down, if it's a biohazard terrorist attack? I mean, why do you expect the United States to trust that? But that's just my personal opinion. I try not to put too much personal opinion and stuff. And so it also says, let's see. So the China people responded with this. In a statement Sunday, China's Ministry of Foreign Affairs said that China will resolutely uphold the relevant company's legitimate rights and interests, and at the same time, reserving the right to take further action in response. China's Ministry of Defense echoed the statement later in the day saying it reserves the right <clears throat> to take necess necessary measures to deal with similar situations. China ain't having it, right? The presence of the balloon in the skies above the United States this week dealt with dealt a severe blow to already strained United States Chinese relationships that have been in a downward spiral for years. So that's what was on the news and that is happening here within our states and with China. I think China just wanted to find a reason. Thanks.